Hello everyone. So now we are going to have unit 5.4. So it is a continuation of the MLA format and we will now be highlighting footnotes in the MLA format. So allow me to share my screen. Okay, footnotes and end notes in MLA format. <clears throat> footnotes and end notes in MLA should be limited as well, as it can be distracting for the reader. It can be used for bibliographic notes that the reader may consult for additional references. Footnotes and end notes can also be used for explanatory or content notes, which add brief additional information, such as uh, what you have seen in APA format. The end notes and the footnotes are supplemental information that are being given as additional content for the information you have provided in your text format. The referencing page for footnotes should be placed before the word cited page. The footnotes and endnotes should be listed in chronological order as they appear in the text with each entry indented for one half inch. This is an example of the footnote. So this meant that musicology in Japan ceased to be a discipline reserved for few committed dynamic scholars and began to acquire a consistent institutional profile 16. In 1963, a further higher study level was introduced, equivalent to the US master's degree. While in 1977, the PhD was introduced about 20 university institutes across the whole national territory establish a musicology department of or course 17. For a library report on the state of musicology in Japan at the time, CFY Nomura Musicology in Japan since uh, 1945. This is an example of a footnote. So additional information on what, what is being mentioned. And also here, the paragraph contains two footnotes about Japanese music. The first footnote refers to additional resources for the reader. Here, if you are going to take a look at this one, this is an additional resources. Acta Musicolo Musicologica. Musicologica. All right, and we have here the second footnote is an explanatory footnote to explain the concept of establishing music courses in Japan. This footnote reference of three diff different sources for the reader. So here. So this one is additional information again, but this one highlighted the concept of establishing music courses in Japan and we have three references. Let's identify them. So the Ashgate Research Companion Japanese Music here and another Context and Change in Japan, page 133, and this one as well. Okay, so if you have noticed, we have three references that is actually being cited for the benefit of explaining the concept of music courses in Japan. So basically, when we say footnote, this is helpful for us to be able to have ideas or more information with regards to the topic or the content being uh, put in your research study. Okay, so that's it for the MLA format in our footnotes or endnotes. So thank you so much for listening.